Stage 13 of the 2012 Dakar this Saturday with 275 kilometers of special between Nazca and Pisco that include a few difficulties for the remaining contestants, a dozen rows of dunes to cross. This should be hard on the systems. In the car overall standing, the suspense is almost over as Stefan Petterenzel has a 20-minute lead over his teammate Nani Roma. Thanks to his experience, the Frenchman should be able to take it to Lima. In the bike category, Marc Coma is the provisional leader, 1 minute 35 ahead of Cyril Desprez. Having won yesterday, he was to open the track today, and that is never easy. This was confirmed at the first checkpoint. The Frenchman was the fastest driver since the start. Behind him were Joan Barret aboard and Helder Rodriguez. Marc Coma was already outrun. Then came the moment of truth of this adventure. Mark Coma chose the wrong direction and lost several minutes. This terrible mistake should cost him a lot at the arrival. Because in the meantime, Cyril Desprez was attacking at full throttle. However, he was not the fastest one in Pisco. The scratch was for Helder Rodriguez of Portugal. The French rider may smile seeing his consolation prize. He made the best out of Marcoma's navigation mistake by taking back the top spot of the GC. There are now 11 minutes and 3 seconds between the two KTM teammates. With a short last stage, 29 kilometers only, Cyril Desprez may have won already. In the car category, since the Dakar has left Mar del Plata, Robbie Gordon was the Phoenix. Yesterday, he proved once again to his rivals that he was the 2012 main threat. But today, the American went through hell. First to leave Nazca, he opened the way at supersonic speed to the first checkpoint. His rivals were trailing far behind. Stefan Petterensel was 7 minutes 16 seconds adrift and Genial de Villiers 8 minutes 41 behind. Then trouble started for the Hummer pilot. First he got stuck at kilometer 182 and lost a precious time. 20 kilometers further, he somersaulted from the front. Thankfully, he and his co-pilot were safe and managed to resume the race. But when things go wrong, they really go wrong for Gordon. After getting stuck in the sand and turning over, one of his tires then punctured. Everything comes in threes. With Gordon out of the way, it was all clear for the minis. At the finish in Pisco, Stefan Petterensel cruised to this penultimate stage win, followed by Genial de Villiers, Leonid Nowitzki, Carlos Souza and Lucio Ezequiel Alvarez. Robbie Gordon had to settle for 10th position, 36 minutes behind Petterensel. The Frenchman confirms his position at the top of the general classification, his teammate Nani Roma is still second and Genial de Villiers climbs to the third step of the podium.